Tomorrow, snow aside, we really are heading into more spring like weather, and that means construction barrels are going to be blooming. And this morning, the folks at Pendot District 12, which covers Westmoreland, Washington Green, and Fayette counties, unveiled their plans for the roads you drive. Bryant Reed has just come out of that briefing and has the latest. Bryant? These are some of the details of District 12's PennDOT projects in Westmoreland, Fayette, Green, and Washington counties in 2022. PennDOT says they're ready to get started now that funding is back to pre-pandemic levels with the help of the bipartisan infrastructure bill. The main focus for drivers will be the Route 51 I-70 interchange for its next diverging diamond in Ross Raver. The work begins there towards the end of April. The clover ramps will be taken out and the diamond will be created on Route 51. They're doing this to improve safety. Lane closures are expected on both roadways. In the area of Yukon and Madison, more work will be done on I-70. PennDOT says first they'll focus on completing current projects there of lane widening through four miles of roadway. PennDOT says the height of the COVID-19 pandemic crippled their projects greatly. What happens is a lot of times is uh, we, we need to get to a job and we don't have the funding to, to get that. So we'll start to design and sometimes it will be done with the design, but it might take a year or two until we can actually fund the construction. What um, this bill has allowed us to do is to advance a lot of projects that were um, may not have been able to advance. Um, it's allowed us to move those forward and, and get them uh, completed. Another main focus, smaller, more local bridge rehab and construction. Now coming up later on KDK, I'll have a full breakdown of some of those bigger projects that you can expect. Reporting, I'm Brian Reed, KDK News.